He molded you. Allah says He created the rest of the skies. He could have added, He created you too. But He's already said that before. He changed it. He said, وَصَوَّرَكُمْ He molded you. Sawwara in Arabic is to fashion something, to mold something, to sculpt something, make a sculpture that's perfect and beautiful. He says, I did a, Allah Himself says, I did a really good job making you. He Himself is telling us. He takes pride in how beautifully He made us. You know what the ungrateful says, why am I so fat? Why am I so skinny? Why am I so short? Why am I so, why do I have freckles? Why do I have this? Why do I have that? How come I'm not smart like my brother? How come that one's rich and I'm poor? How come I don't have this and how come I don't have that? And you know what happens in this society, especially in modern society, and it's happening globally, not just in America. People start getting old, the hair starts going, start turning gray a little bit, right? Then you notice, you know, uh, uh, wrinkles on your skin. So you, and this entire multi-million dollar industry to make sure that you look like you did when you were 20 and you end up looking like a zombie. Right? But they'll, they'll, they'll put hair implants on you and they'll stretch your skin for you and they'll tuck your belly in for you and they'll do all these things to you so maybe you can pretend you're still 25. Allah is saying, accept who you are. I think you're beautiful. Why do you think you're ugly? Why do you have to be so unhappy with yourself? <laughs> he did, did a beautiful job with you. And molding is not just in the physical sense, even in our personalities, our capabilities. Allah has given each and every one of us certain strengths, certain abilities, certain talents. He is the one who gave them to us. So when we don't appreciate what we've been given, then we're not appreciating Allah Himself. Because He's the one who gave. Just like when somebody gives you a gift and you don't appreciate it, you're not, not, you're, you, it's a disrespect to the one who gave you the gift. All of what we have been given is a gift from Allah Azza wa Jal. وَصَوَّرَكُمْ فَأَحْسَنَ صُوَرَكُمْ And if you don't recognize that, وَإِلَيْهِ الْمَصِيرِ it'll all be, You'll all be going back to him anyway. Whether you take advantage of these gifts or not, they will have to be returned to the original owner. To him is the final return eventually anyway.